Hey guys, so we are back and we are now going to film a big collective haul um, from this past, what, month? Yeah. Just about a month. And so yeah, it's pretty, this pretty is big. gonna be pretty long, so mm -hmm. stay tuned. So I guess I'll start off with what I purchased at Target. So the first thing is this bikini. Now I don't really, change up bikinis like I'm not a person who has like 20 bikinis I don't yeah. know how people can have that many so I just got these bottoms and they kind of remind me of like the triangle bikini especially the top so I liked it because it was like Turk and perp and they're <laughs> really cute so and it's pretty flattering too so I went to this kind of local clothing store in Vegas and I just got this black strapless jumpsuit and it's super comfortable. I wore it once and it's just Cute. so soft. Mm -hmm. Like, I, I love things like this. Like it's basic. And comfortable. And comfortable, but you look good. So the next thing I got at Target was this set of two bandanas. And now I like the look of bandanas like in your hair with like a bun or something. So I really wanted a red one, but they only had black and white. So I just got these. Cute. This next thing I have is from Victoria's Secret. And I went when they were having the sale so, oh, so this, it's just like a long sleeve top, and on the back it says love pink. Can I love the color. Yeah. I know, I love the color, and I love these, like, oh, wait, these sleeves. Mm -hmm. And I think it was originally like $44, but I got it for $30. Yay me. And yeah, it's just comfortable. I wish it was in a small, but... Oh. I like that it's in a medium too, so you can like wear it with leggings. Okay, so then I went to H&M and I got this really long cardigan that was for sale and it was only, I think like $15 when it was originally like $40. So yeah, it's super long and flowy and it's just perfect for summer. I went to Forever 21 quite a lot <laughs> and one of the times I went there, I just got these two tank tops. Yeah. Tank tops. And so I got one in this kind of turquoise color, and then I just got one in black. Mm -hmm. Always gotta have Basics, one in black. Yes. And these are only like 180 each. I need to get some. And then I also went to Forever 21, and I picked up this like muscle tee, mm -hmm. and it says New York, our favorite city, <laughs> and 90. And then yeah, it's just cute. It has like really oversized like arm holes and then it has a little hood which is cute so i'll start with these two tops because i got them at the same place i don't know it was like some ratchet little store and all their clothes were like one two or three dollars so i went in there and i saw this crop top and i thought it was so cute with like i think this would be cute with like black high-waisted pants oh i love that and then every time I go to Vegas, I get something with the British flag on it. And I saw this, and I don't know, when I first saw it, I thought it looked ratchet as fuck. But I think if you just wear it, like pair it with the right bottoms, mm -hmm. I think it would be really cute. Yeah, and it's cute. just another crop top. Then also at Forever 21, I got this jumpsuit. And I don't even know how it goes. <laughs> this is what it looks like. It has this pattern on it. And I really like the back because it has like a cutout. And then you just button this part and so there's like a hole so you see a little bit of your back and yeah it's just super comfortable and perfect for summer. I went to Goodwill mm. and I was on the hunt for high-waisted pants to make into shorts and I got a few but while I was there I got these leggings that um, my cousin just mm. cut up for me and That's cute. they're so cute I can't wait to wear these. I love the rips in them and then I just got Ooh. more like I found two pairs of high-waisted pants and I cut them into shorts well my cousin did for me and I just got like regular blue jeans and then these are just black ones next I went to foreign exchange and I got this Brandy Melville looking sweater and it's just plain black and it was on sale for ten dollars which was a really good deal so compared to brandy that's like yeah it's super good so i've been wearing this like every day this summer speaking of brandy <laughs> <laughs> i got this halter top from there it's a white one and i also got a black one but i don't 
know where it is. <laughs> I think I left it at my friend's house. But yeah, I just got a white one. <laughs> and then we went to Brandy Melville a couple days ago. So I picked up these really comfortable like pajama shorts and they're just plain black and they have cute little ruffles and these are perfect for like summer nights when it's super hot and you can't sleep. So I think I went to Cotton On and just got this maxi dress. It's just blue with white stripes and I love, I have one maxi dress from Cotton On and it's so comfortable so I just had to get another one. And then also at Brandy Melville I picked up this crop top and it's kind of similar to Jazzy's except it's not a halter and yeah these are kind of fun because you don't like wear a bra with them so I love that. it's comfortable. It's yeah. really comfortable. Free the nipple. I thought it would be uncomfortable <laughs> but no. Yeah it's really comfortable. Just beware of cold places. Oh yeah. So then I went to H&M and I got oh, this so shirt. Cute. It's It looks really big but it's a small. So I think this would be so like New York City. Place. Yes, and it says New York City on it. If you can see that. Oh, so cute. And then I don't know, I just love the floral pattern on it. I think the colors are beautiful and it's really like soft, like it's light material. Mm -hmm. So you could wear it like in hot weather and it'll still be good. I wore it all the time in Vegas and it was like one something there. So I'm just gonna go through the rest of the clothes that I got really quickly. Uh, I just got these kind of taupey harem pants mm. and they're really comfortable and I don't even know where I got them. It was just like another random store. But yeah, I'm excited to wear those. And then I also got these at Goodwill. Ooh. They're kind of like, they're tight on top and then they flare out on the bottom. Mm -hmm. And I love the pattern and I really got the the white halter top that I got from Brandy Melville. I got it to wear with these pants because I think it would just be so cute. And then I also got this from Victoria's Secret. It's just another sweater. It's blue and it says love pink. I think it was like $20. So that was a steal. Mm -hmm. And then I got this romper from Forever 21. Oh, I love the color. I know, I love the color. It's like perfect for summer. Mm -hmm. And yeah, I haven't worn it yet, but I'm excited too. It just gets wrinkly a lot, so. And then lastly, um, from Urban Outfitters, I got this. It's inside Ooh. out, but it's pretty <laughs> much the same like pattern. It's just like a knit, kind of like a dark brown sweater. It's so comfortable and it's really cute and I got it on sale for $9. So I guess we'll move on to miscellaneous items. So I'll start off with my 3D pressed whitening strips and I got these at Costco for $30 and it came with the glamorous white strips and the one hour express. So this was a gift that my aunt got me. She got me a couple little things but I think this is what I'm most excited for and it's just this journal that she gave me and I think I'm going to use it as kind of like a freshman year diary mm -hmm. kind of thing. So I can like look back on this in years and oh, that's so cute. Went and like just read how I felt during my freshman year of college. So I recently got my hair bleached to do ombre and it's coming out like really orange in the camera but it's not, it's pretty blonde. So I got the Color Me Happy Herbal Essences Shampoo and Conditioner, and they smell so good, and I really like them so far. So I got these at Target. I got these two pairs of sunglasses from Aldo. They were having a sale on their sunglasses, and they were two for 20. So I just got these and these, and I love these, oh, these because the sides, cute. they're like gold, kind of, they look like chains. And then before graduation, I realized I was curling my hair and it was gonna be really hot outside, so I needed hairspray. So I picked up the Garnier Fructis Volumizing Anti-Humidity Hairspray and it's just this bottle and I'm probably never going to use it but I just got it anyway. <laughs> I guess this is another thing that my aunt got me as a gift. It's like a little charm for a bracelet and it's a little cupcake if you guys can see that. But it's really cute, I just need to get a bracelet to put it on but I really love the charm. And also for my hair, I picked up the Herbal Essences Dry Shampoo in Color Me Happy, and this stuff smells so good. 
It smells like oh my god, really floral and just fresh. And the stuff actually works really well. One time, I guess. When I was packing for Vegas, I totally forgot to bring my moisturizer with me. So one time when I was at Target, I just picked up this clean and clear dual action moisturizer. The last product for my hair is the Aussie 3 Minute Miracle Moist. And I just got this for as a deep conditioner and it works pretty well. I got a few things for my hair while I was in Vegas because I had been dyeing it so many times that it was just dead. and. Oh, did we film a video since I dyed my hair? No, this oh. is the first brown hair. <laughs> so yes, I didn't want to go as dark as my hair was before, but I didn't exactly want to keep dyeing my hair blonde, so I just went with the brown. And so I've been trying to kind of get my hair healthier, and I mean, it's, gonna, it's a slow process, mm -hmm. I can see, but... So yeah, I just got some curl enhancing smoothie from Shea Moisture and I got this at I mean I'm pretty sure you can get this anywhere mm -hmm. but this is what it looks like and it smells really good mm -hmm. but I don't know I feel like it's so thick and I don't like that feeling in my hair at Rite Aid um, I ran out of moisturizer about a month ago, so I picked up the Garnier Moisture Rescue Refreshing Gel Cream for combination skin, and it's just like this green gel. It feels really nice, especially in the summertime when you're out in the sun all the time, so I really like it. I kind of have been getting <laughs> more like into accessories and like bracelets and necklaces, so I got a few of those while I was in Vegas. Like, I got this oh, so cute. chain bracelet. It's just like two chains and they're like wrapped around each two other. <laughs> and yeah, they're really cute. I love, I feel like I got a lot of like gold chains. You'll see yeah. soon, but yeah, I really like this bracelet. I think we shot it in a previous video a yeah. long time ago. We had it was the last. Yeah, was, was it last, last summer? Yeah, we had matching oh my God. infinity necklaces, but I think, oh yeah, I lost mine during cross country practice and I think yours mine broke. broke. Yeah. <laughs> so then we were like, okay, it's time to get new ones. So we got matching bracelets at Forever 21. One has like two hearts connected and then the other is like a band that says happiness and they're just really cute and dainty. Yeah. And we love gold. Like everyday so. bracelets. Yeah. So I got these while I was in Vegas. Really, my cousin got them for me, but I picked them out. And they're just these set of like bangles. They're like silver and gold. And I think they're so Those cute. Those are really cute. Also at Rite Aid, I picked up the L'Oreal Paris Magic Lumi Primer. And I saw Jaclyn Hill using this in a tutorial. So I thought I'd try it out. And so far it's pretty good. It gives you a really nice dewy finish. <sighs> so it got really tangled, but <laughs> you can still kind of see like what it's like. It just kind of a bunch of like small necklaces with hearts. Oh, that's like so right there. And I think it's so cute, like just to wear kind of like every day. And then I also got this bracelet. It's just a gold chain, of course. And then it has like kind of a big bow. And I love that, it's so cute. And then my cousin just got this for me. It's like a little kind of bracelet <laughs> and it says love on it but I love the colors like the blue and the gold together and also at Rite Aid <clears throat> a long time ago I had this mascara which is the L'Oreal Voluminous Original and I ran out of it about like two years ago so I wanted to pick it up again and I love that. it's amazing I got a couple things from MAC and I've been wanting a lip pencil like just a nude lip pencil so I got this one in Dervish, and it's like a nude. <laughs> it's really pretty. Oh, that one is pretty. If you can see that, it's right there. It's like, I think it's the perfect like pinky nude lip liner for my skin at least. And then I also got a lipstick in Viva Glam 3. 
And this one's so beautiful. I can't wait to wear this one. Again, from Rite Aid, I picked up these two brushes, um, a little smudger brush, because I don't really have one this size, and it's just the Rite Aid Renewal brand. And then I picked up this Eco Tools Airbrush Concealer brush, because I thought it was cute, and it was on sale too. The next few things I got, they were from my uncle as a graduation present, and he just got me like a bunch of mac things like and i'm surprised he even like knew <laughs> knew like anything oh so first he got me the lipstick and chatterbox and it's just like a bright pink and i love wearing this with like it's like a barbie kind of thing but it's like toned down and i think this is super pretty i love wearing this like in the middle of my lips with CoverGirl's lipstick and Spellbound on the outside, so it's like an ombre lip. Oh, so pretty. Got me this cream sheen glass in Jet Boy, and this is so cool. Like, I saw it and I was like, what the fuck, what am I gonna do with that? But it's so pretty. It's like... Like greenish? Uh, yeah, gray, like greenish gray with like gold sparkles in it. You can see the gold in it mm -hmm. maybe a little bit in person you definitely can and then he got me this pro color compact Ooh. oh my gosh i love these <sighs> colors they're so bright and that yellow Ooh, oh my gosh. Gosh. it's so pretty and then this is just a mixing medium the eyeliner one i don't know yeah. it just looks like that and then a glitter. It's just silver glitter. So everybody has been obsessing over Kylie Jenner's lips. So I decided to go out and try to find like a dupe for what um, colors she uses. So I heard from Jaclyn Hill, well, not personally on YouTube, um, that Max lip pencil in Whirl is a pretty good dupe for what she's wearing, or it's like the actual thing. So that's what it looks like. It's just a really dark mauvey pink and then I picked up Urban Decay's Revolution Lipstick in Liar. <gasps> Why did I even do it, Jessie? <laughs> oh my god you guys. It chipped off the top. How did that happen? But anyway, it's just this brownish pink color and I'm just gonna kind of smooth it out. But yeah, that's what it looks like, <laughs> and these two together make a beautiful lip combination. I went to Sephora once, and I was trying really hard not to buy any makeup, but uh, I, can't, I couldn't do it. I got the Anastasia Tinted Brow Gel in Espresso, and I love this with the Dip Brow. Oh my gosh, you guys. Mm. It's just like a tint, tinted gel. That's what it's called. Mm -hmm. And I don't know, I just like to use this on kind of the inner part of my brow and then I use the dip brow at the end and whew, it's just so nice. I also got some things from Sephora. I first picked up the Ultra Repair Cream by First Aid Beauty and I think every beauty guru talks about this product and it's actually really nice too. And then I also picked up the Purity Made Simple Face Cleanser by Philosophy and again a lot of people talk about this product so I thought I'd give it a try. I went into I think Target once and I mean can you ever stop yourself from buying makeup products at Target? Mm -hmm. I think not. So, I got this Vaseline Lip Therapy shit. It's so and, tiny. And it's the one with cocoa butter. Oh, I love that And stuff. this stuff is so nice. It makes my lips feel so soft. And then I got this Rimmel Show Off Lip Lacquer. And it's in the shade Aurora. And I'm wearing it right now. And it's so pretty. And, and that's it right there. I love these lip products. They're so nice. And then I just got this lipstick from Revlon in Smoked Peach. Just a pretty peachy nude. And I also went to Target and I picked up this St. Ives Even and Bright Pink Lemon and Mandarin Orange Scrub. And it's a new product they have and you guys, it smells freaking amazing. 
Oh my gosh. I haven't tried it yet, but I'm really excited to. I also picked up the Sonia Kashuk Tinted Brow Gel, and I've never tried anything from Sonia Kashuk, so this, this is actually a really good product. So I ran to Target, and I got this eyeliner pencil from NYC, but I used it for my eyebrows. And I really like this product. This is my second one, and I think it was in the shade Bold Brown. This is actually a pretty nice eyebrow pencil. There it is, right mm. there. And then I just got this e.l.f. 3-in-1 mascara. Uh, this is what the wand mm. looks like. I haven't tried it yet, so I don't really have an opinion on it, but when I do, I will let you guys know. And then I went to Bath & Body Works when they were having their semi-annual sale, so I picked up this Maui Hibiscus Beach Shower Gel. That's what it looks like, it's pretty color. And this smells super good. Mm. And then I picked up the Oahu Coconut Sunset Body Spray, and I really like the packaging. I like nice. the way they changed it. And this one smells really good too. Mm. It's very coconutty. Mm -hmm. I also went to Bath & Body Works when they were having their sale. And I got a few things, a couple. Um, I got this shower gel in black raspberry vanilla. This is one of my favorite scents from Bath & Body Works and then they discontinued it, but then they brought it back and ugh. It smells so fucking good. Oh, this is I dead. really want to eat, it smells like a slurp slurp. <gasps> This is my other favorite scent from Bath & Body Works. It's from their aromatherapy line. It's mm. the Eucalyptus Spearmint. And I got the body cream. It just, it smells so good. I love so it. Relaxing. I went to Rite Aid the other day, just looking around, and I saw a new display for Maybelline, and I freaked out because I know they came out with new color tattoos. And then um, they had all of them in stock, so I texted Jazzy asking which one she wanted because I know we always have to get like the same things. So I picked up Creamy Beige, which is just this really pretty creamy beige color. Oh, I'm so pretty. And then I picked up Chocolate Suede, and it's just this really nice dark chocolate brown with some gold shimmer in it. Kelly, being the excellent friend she is, she got me two of them, and I got the same, one of the same ones in creamy beige, and I just love this one. It's like a great primer, mm -hmm. a primer It's like color. a MAC paint pot. Yeah, and then I got this one in vintage oh, plum. That one's so pretty. At MAC, because I did my boyfriend's PowerPoint presentation like three months ago for school, um, he offered to buy me a blush, so I got the MAC powder blush in copper tone and this is just such a pretty orangey brown color and I love these kind of colors so I had to get it. Jazzy, being the amazing friend she is, <laughs> um, gave me an extra lipstick and this is in Cyber and it's a satin finish and oh, I've been wanting this lipstick for a really long time so I'm glad <laughs> she got it for me. I got two pairs of sandals and Converse so the first one are these nude. Mm -hmm sandals with like chain, a gold it's oh, like it's a rose gold cute. kind yeah. of chain on it and, and then i just got these new sandals and they're super comfortable and they were only nine dollars so and then i just got a pair of white high top converse i've been wanting these for so long and i think they're so cute if you guys didn't know i didn't have a phone up until like three weeks ago and um, I got the iPhone 5C in blue, and then I got this Justin Bieber phone case from Etsy, and he just looks so fine on it. And I also picked up four. Now, if you guys didn't know, we're obsessed with the Divergent trilogies, so when I found out Veronica Roth was coming out with like a book based on four's perspective, I had to get it, and so far, I'm really liking it. I'm so excited for this. My aunt, who is a manager at a Mac store in Vegas, she got this for me. She said it's the one that they use, or that she uses, and it's like an air compressor, like an airbrush machine. So I'm not trying to take all the parts to this out right now, but you can just see the picture. Oh, That's so what it looks like. It looks like the only <laughs> bad thing is that this one that she got, it has like a European plug 
So I need to find a piece that connects that to like our outlets. That was the machine and then she got me the little pen or whatever for it. She got me two of the MAC Pro Performance HD Airbrush Makeup. This one is in NC50 and then she got me one in NC35 so I can like mix them. So one more thing, I went to Ross and I wanted to get a new bag. So I was looking for them and they had some pretty cute ones but when I saw this one I <laughs> fell in love and it is a Betsy Johnson bag and so it's like cute. nude it's like a nude. Yeah, it's nude. nude white, and I love these hearts. I think I saw on the tag that it was supposed to be $100, like, from the Betsy Johnson website or whatever, but I got it for $40. Well, that is it for our huge collective summer haul. We hope you guys enjoyed the video, and we're back with a bunch more coming your way. So don't forget to follow us on Instagram and Twitter at jkbd 8 and we'll see you in the next video. Bye, guys. Bye.